After so long, I decided to make a horror game. But it's not just any type of horror game. It's actually a remake of one of my games that I made a long time ago. About a year ago. Kind of quit it on the project, but seems like I'm going back in to remake it. So guys, as you can see, I, I started working on the map as like in the original game, but it seems like it's going to be more tinier. But it, it's okay, because it doesn't really matter, and we're just going to be like the only people that's going to... Well, you're gonna be like the only people that are just gonna be there. And I'm starting to plan for maybe, uh, what's it called, P multiplayer? And as you can see, I put an Arthro rig, but I'm not actually gonna make the game Arthro. I was just checking the size so I can make sure. Well, I was gonna make it Arthro because it was gonna be single player, but I might make it where it's like, um, multiplayer if you want that. I think that'd be pretty good, uh, yeah, I'm making like the parking lots. Yeah. As you can see, I'm just working on the other stuff. Making it a little bit more tinier. Working on the stuff. Yeah, I, I keep saying the same thing. Sorry. Um, yeah, as you can see, I put it in a folder so I can. So it's all sorted out and it's not just like a whole thing. So as, uh, I duplicate. Get all the parts and just duplicate them so I can. Make it look a bit better. And as you can see, it looks like a decent parking spot. Lot, I meant parking lot. I was just taking a look at cars just to see if there was like an old one for no reason. I have no idea why I was looking for one. And as you can see, I'm making the sidewalk. And you know, I'm just trying to find a good texture for the sidewalk. And I found one. Then I started making another lot. And then I you uh, make it a bit thicker so you can walk through it like uh you know like one of those things that you go to the store with and they have like those that they you can walk over with so you know where to go like you know what i'm talking about where i'm going with this so as you can see i uh i made like this faded text right here so it looks like it was like torn down and i made these like cool looking lights not the best type looking lights but you know so I started making the lights, two lights, and I scrapped one earlier, and I'm, as you can see, I'm actually putting it in the parking lot, so yeah. So, uh, as you can see, I got done with one of the lights that I just made, and so far the parking lot actually looks pretty good, and yeah. So let's get to one of the important things that took me forever to decide to make. So, as you can see, I started making a plane, oh yeah, I'm gonna try to not talk that fast, um... So, I watched a tutorial by Road Builder, and he shows me how this is working, and I tried, so I made some tests, and it's going to be sped up, so we're going to get, like, through the thing. That's going to be very fast. So, as you can see, now I'm making one of the mountains that I was planning to make. Oh, never mind. I guess I was trying to make more, so, oops, or, you know. Then I start making the mountains, and I'm arranging them so they look pretty good. Then I'm just doing silly things with it, just messing around just to make it look good. Now I put it a subdivision, I think it's that's what it's called. Then I started fixing some things, added more like mountains and stuff. Then I exported it, then it looked pretty good actually. Then I started to resize it, then I added a texture to it. And stuff and I'm not trying to make this like a very long video uh, I hope you're enjoying this I consider you're subscribing to me and I would actually appreciate it because I try my best to make these videos I haven't been posting lately but just trying my best and as you can see I'm starting to add some type of like four things so it looks pretty good and it's just for like the ground because you can go through the ground and now I'm making like this little alley for like more detail but even though you're not going to be able to go over here and see it or go through it because it's it's kind of worthless but it still works for like a little detail then i move the mountain then almost soon add more mountains that are like a bit tinier then put them inside the mountain so it's more nice more nicer as you can say then i make a folder called mountains then uh just working on the mountains, duplicating them, then that should be it. Um, 
yeah, I just duplicate these, then that, 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 and just adding more details. Then I add, move some of the stuff. Then I duplicate the parts and just resize them so they can fit. Then I add more mountains for background. Then I do that. Make another alley that has the matching blue and that that side. Now I start working on the flashlight. So I'm just naming it. Then I put it at the position, as the tutorial said. And also, I am not a script. I am very new to scripting, so I have to like watch tutorials and stuff. But I do know how to oh, simply, simply script. Not that hard. It's it is hard if you're advanced. Advanced scripting is very hard. But as you can see, I'm trying to make some type of ring, but it seems like it's not working. Then I got the script called Flash, then I start working on the variables, then the run service flashlight, then I'm just copying all the code from the tutorial, not that hard, just doing all that stuff, then I make functions, and I'm working on that, 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 then, yeah, start making the UIs and the toggle. So the toggle is for like the, the flashlight. So then I make a brightness. Then if I want it to be toggable oh, and press a key or, you know, key bind to make it key code F. And also, I'll be working on mobile and one of the next parts, maybe. But I still have, like, a list to do. And, yeah. I'm just testing out the script and stuff. Now, as you can see, I just got done with the flashlight. and added a little, like, point light. So, like, if you have your flashlight on, you'll have, like, a little point light. And I need to fix it where there's invisible walls so you don't get on the hills and, like, get out of bounds and stuff. But, yeah. Look, so far it looks good. The factory, I mean, the, the kindergarten. This is like the second time I said factory. And now that's the end of the video. I hope you enjoyed. Uh, subscribe to me and send some support for the game. And send it to your friends and subscribe to me, please. I'm trying to get 1K. And I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye, guys.